Hello everyone, Malekith here, and welcome to Ultimate General Civil War. Now for those who remember, there was Ultimate General Gettysburg, uh, made by, I think it's Flying Labs, and in conjunction with Darth from the Darth mod uh, selection of Total War mods. So this is their follow-up game, which is obviously called Civil War. I believe it's in early access and available on Steam, and it's... A much sort of wider scale, um, kind of a more story-based flow through the entire war, I believe. I'm not sure how much sort of world map decisions you get to make. I only really played the first battle just to set the sounds up. Uh, so we'll have to find that out. But it does seem to be a bit more freeform than Gettysburg, which was pretty much just throw you into a set of pre-made battles. So um, we will see. Yay, so beginning. You've always dreamed to become a military. A oh, that's loud. We will turn the volumes down a bit. Permanently. Half slave. It is your destiny to serve your nation a in the battlefield and become a war hero. Against itself cannot stand. This government cannot hmm. endure permanently. Half slave. Let's go strategists. So you have graduated from West Point War Academy with specialization in strategy and realized the necessity of hard training for an efficient army. of Mississippi, by a solemn ordinance of her people in convention assembled, has declared her separation from the United States. Hmm. So medicine heals your units after the battle. We need logistics. Reduce... Uh, one of the worst things that can happen during a battle is to run out of ammo. Logistics reduces possibility because it increases the starting ammo of all your units. Training. Losing some of your best troops is unavoidable in this bloody war. Increasing your training allows you to replenish unit losses with new veterans for a lower cost and keep the unit skills at a high level. Reconnaissance. Helps you know your enemy. Well, that's nice and descriptive. Um, I'm going to go with infantry. And then further career. After finishing your army career, you establish a company. Your business was very successful. You made a lot of money. You go into the army or you go into politics. So economy. Increasing your level in economy will reduce the cost of purchasing new weapons. Skill us to maintain your army well equipped. Organization. Uh, as level increases, you can have more core divisions and brigades to allocate your recruits. Or politics. Politics influence the amount of recruits and money you receive during the war. Being good in politics will certainly favour your army in the long term. I'm going to go with politics. So when you left the army, you continued to build your career as a politician. Being highly educated and skillful in managing people helped you become a congressman. And I'm going to fight for the Union. The southern states have declared a secession from the United States to support... Uh, you support the abolition of slavery, so you have no other choice but to support the Union. You'll have almost endless resources to raise, uh, to raise a powerful army and crush the rebellion. And then this looks like a difficult setting. So on the lowest difficulty you get bonus to golden recruits, reduced enemy strength, and a re reduced reputation drop. Opposite at the other end. We'll go for Brigadier General. If you're a confident general, you don't need additional support or assist any kind. Big challenge awaits you, and you're up for the fight. There we go. There's our stats. So income 7.5%, discount 2.5%, veteran cost reduction, ammo is just standard, recruiting boost, unit restore normal, core number one, enemy info none. Begin. In general, our main objective is to secure this small town and its railroad station. According to our scouts, the garrison should not exceed 3,000 soldiers. We must capture the town before rebel reinforcements arrive via railroad. Advised, use your vanguard to clear the town's perimeter from skirmishes or other threats. 
The rest of our, your forces are en route and will arrive from the southwest. to sort the town when your force, when all your forces are present. Nice road with some cliffs. Forests. Yeah. We're going to go up this way, please. I have no intention of walking along what is very clearly ambush alley between forests and mountains and the end of a valley. Uh, your general provides valuable command bonuses to units inside his command radius, increasing the morale and effectiveness. Good to know. Fall, charge, fall back, hold fire. So we've got Stockton, Schaefer and Zook. Look at these beards. Mustaches. Excellent. Nah, yeah, I thought so. Hello. Push you through the trees. Bring up the men. Oh, they can shoot from a long way away. Just killed ten of my guys. We killed seven. Why are you retreating out of range? Get back in range. No. Back in range. Idiots. Back in range. The Schaefer coming from the side. Oh. Got burns. Backing them up. Hello. Oh, go on then, turn around. Exama. Gonna take a full rifle volley. Ooh. Range attack is affected from equipped weapon and unit skills, but also targets distance, attitude, and ground cover. Oh, blast him. Blast him. Fire! Yep, he's running. So are we, though, apparently. Get in there. I don't know why they keep running away. I'm sure I remember having this issue with... Blanked? What? Oh, getting shot from below. How can you shoot up a cliffside like that? Detached skirmishers. Ooh. Yeah, all right. Aha, reinforcements. Cavalry, bring them up. They'll be helpful. Bristow. So we've got a couple of units. Ooh, artillery pieces. Alright, let's put them on the hill. And a supply wagon. I'm guessing is how you get ammo. All right, I've had enough charge. Come on, boys, get him! Get him! Yeah. Henry back in the town as there's artillery pieces. The 
can go to there. We can supply. Waterton. We're going through the woods. So Zook's poor blokes are exhausted. But they have absolutely murdered those skirmishers. They won't be coming back. A bit of a scout further north, shall we? Air conditions 89, air at full, air at 88. I'll have them hold. They can just rest up, get the condition back, we'll march them along the road, and then can rejoin in later. Thirty kills, thirty-six deaths. Say five kills, eight deaths. What did these guys pull off? One hundred and sixty kills, fifty-seven deaths. Not bad ratio so far. Push my scouts down to the bottom of the uh, hill there. Yeah, so we've got enemy infantry hidden in the sort of like barricade type thing. Quite a lot of them, 932. Looks like my cannons are lining up to shoot. March them along the road. Oh, yep, yeah, we're hitting them nicely. Good. Push the general down with the infantry. Where's my supply cart? Get over here with the cannon. Oh, hello. Back, back, back. Alright, let's send one of the scout units, one of the infantry units up north. We'll have these guys come forward to try and take the town, supported by Stockton. Zook's guys can just sit there and replenish for a bit. We'll hook them in. It looks like we've got two rivers to push over. I want to threaten both. Alright, we've got our cannon support. Move in. Multiple angles. Well. We're being charged, Captain. Counter charge! Oh dear, my skirmishers just got murdered. Units panicked and will be out of control until it feels safe. Try to keep morale high to avoid such events. Yes, okay. I thought skirmishers wouldn't have been able to run a bit faster than uh, a full block of infantry. But we have broken them horribly. They're not coming back anytime soon. Oh, 
Alright, let's move a cannon in each direction. Why are my guys running as well? Come on, Zook. Alright, Loomis needs to sit around for a bit. His morale's down, his condition's down. Even Zook's condition's not great. Avamelli's facing the right way to fight McHenry. Woods here is uh, lining up for some shots on him. Their uh, ratio is pretty good. How are my cannons doing? Eight kills. Well, not amazing. Oh, hello. Pushing from the flank here, see what we can achieve. They've got cannon. Okay, time to go. Oh, they've got a lot of people. No, back away, back away. Do not want to try and force a river crossing with inferior numbers and not enough support from other angles. river which is a problem they're taking a lot of shots though we're picking them off a lot quicker than our guys Suki's getting shot at but have him push in from the flank Yeah, my cavalry is in there now as well. Taking flanking fire. Cannon. Shoot at those guys. Alright, Walter. Make them charge. There you go, McHenry's routing. I think our best bet is to try and cross the bridge here. Loomis can't run anymore. Wharton's running. Like, actually running, running. Bristow, get up here. The unit officer is killed or wounded. The unit suffers from severe penalties during battle. Uh oh. Schaefer's been uh, taken out. You guys, stop running around like idiots. Alright, 
Let's have Loomis provide fire support and have Zoop charge. Oops. Walton. Useless bastard. Fine, stand there and recover. Schaefer. You need the general affecting down here. I meant to provide fire support, Loomis. Not walk in. Where's my cavalry gone? What are you doing down there? Well, that hasn't gone well. My main problem with, always with this game was condition. It just wears down so quickly and then takes so long to recover. Oh, there we go. We've got it. We've broken law. That means my cavalry can get across and hopefully murder these artillery pieces. Born Bristow. There we go, we got them. Their artillery's down. Now I've got to get across this stupid place and up and capture this with two minutes to go and units that are exhausted. I'll leave Schaefer with the guns actually just to protect them in case. Their ammo. Ah. They steal the supply. Here's what I thought would happen. Hello, McHenry. That range, the cannon should be murder. 207, egg on the guns. Oh yeah. Ammo. Oh, they're getting low. Supply. the guns across. There we go, that's them broken. And we've captured it. And the cavalry's gonna run. Schaefer's gonna push from this side with Wharton. Both exhausted, but there's nothing, nothing else I can do. Oh, hello. Where did you come from? Well, we got them in a flanking fire. Could have two sets of cannons dealing with them as well. Yep, that's not going to go well.
contested. My cavalry. Hiding there. Looks like everything's running, except burns. Aha! We got it. Rebels prepare for a counterattack. 